Hello everyone, this is Rick Durden reporting for AvWeb from EAA AirVenture 2014. I'm standing in front of an electric airplane, the Sunflyer from PC Aero. It's got solar panels on the wings and a battery pack that drive its electric motor. Charlie Johnson, head of the company, is going to be speaking with us about this airplane and the two-place trainer that's going to be developed from it. The idea is to cut the cost of flight training by over half. Hey, well, the aircraft we're standing in front of was built by PC Aero in Germany, just south of Munich. It is a fully electric powered airplane, has two motors that are coupled together, so it operates like a single engine airplane. Uh, composite fuselage, very lightweight, two Panasonic battery packs, and we really feel very strongly that electric propulsion is the wave of the future, and this is a tremendous example of that. Where we're going uh, with this airplane right now is we're going to take it back to Denver and start flying it in early September do a lot of flight test work, proof of concept type work, and at the same time we're developing a two-seat trainer version of the aircraft, which will start flying uh, late in the first quarter or early in the second quarter of next year. And the plan is to build an airplane that is especially well adapted to flight school to help drive the cost of flying down uh, very significantly and be a very environmentally friendly at the same time. How is this going to drive the cost of flying down? One of the most exciting things about this airplane is we literally will be able to fly for about $5 to $10 an hour worth of electricity versus avgas uh, at the rate of 50 to 75 in a conventional airplane right now. The airplane maintenance costs will be much lower. Uh, the airframe costs will be much lower because it's all composite and uh, the savings are going to be significant. Well, what is our target market? Basically with this initial airplane we are targeting flight schools and initial flight training. One of the biggest barriers right now to flying for people is the cost of flying. There's a tremendous pilot shortage that's coming up and we want to make it affordable with the ATP requirements to get up to 1500 hours right now. We'll be able to cut the cost of somebody getting a license by probably 60 to 80 percent. A little bit about the solar aspects of the airplane. Uh, as you see the wing has solar panels on each side. Basically what that does and a lot of people look at doing is adds 15 percent plus or minus a little bit to the in-flight duration, but more especially you can park the airplane outside and in two to three days it will basically recharge itself at no cost. Our, what is our target price for the airplane? Basically we are looking to get the airplane produced as inexpensively or cost efficiently as possible and we believe the cost will be 180000 or below, uh, which may seem a little high for a two-seat trainer, but when you look at the cost of operations that you save within the first year to two, you'll have made back all of that money and be putting money in the bank. Uh, for more information, uh, we are on the web. We are www.aeac.com uh, and we'd be happy to uh, respond to you.